Well, hey. Hey, what's going on? Guess what? <laughs> I fixed it. You know what that means? I gotta go. I gotta go get some more gold. I gotta clean out that spot, so let's do this. You gonna cue the music or what? Come on, let's go. That's better. <laughs> let's go. didn't rain hardly at all, but my dry path right here has disappeared. So I got my water shoes on already. I'm going to get over there one way or the other. Let's do this. All right, I made it. I left my shoes over there, I had them in my five gallon bucket and I started to cross right there and of course that's a, a deeper point so the vast majority of the current's coming through there and that was, uh, <laughs> that was fun but I made it and I'm here. Now the rock that I was sitting on to pan is right there. That's about a foot and a half, maybe two feet below the water level. So that little bit of rain, just a little, I mean it didn't even rain hard, caused all this water to rise that much. Why? Because it has nowhere to go. <laughs> Alright, so I get in here and I realize I didn't bring my pry bar with me. So hopefully I can make do with what I got. Shovel and those. And this here, hopefully I don't break it. And I got a flathead screwdriver with me too, but it's a short one, so. But I'll manage. Go figure. I get that fixed and I forget the pry bar. <laughs> oh well. All right, let's see what I can do. I gotta find a new place to sit the pan. pieces nothing real spectacular I mean there's some chunky pieces in there that bigger one up there is kind of round so those here's the the upper pockets that I've been working on this one I've been saving till last but I've decided to go ahead and hit it a lot broke out of there and I still have to clean it and suck out the bottom plus these two little pockets right here so that's what that came out of just the surface stuff and the sun's trying to come out and I really wish I brought my pry bar with me 
darn it. Because I've already, uh, I already slightly bent the tip of that. Oh well. Alright, keep working. come down quite a bit that little rock in front of the bigger one right there water was raging over the top of it when I got here you couldn't even see the well you could see the top of it but it was completely submerged so the water's gone down probably a good three inches so that's good and I just got my first significant pan 78 pieces in it I'll show it to you in a second here but I'm getting up into this this area here and breaking pieces out this is all filled with rock all the way in here and that's a good I don't know from from here back was all filled with rock so a bunch of pieces have come out of here up in there and these will keep coming out providing I can do it with my shovel so all the pans that I've done up to this point have been like 15 20 pieces per pan so I didn't even bother but this one was a good 78 pieces And with the glare, I can't see what you're seeing, so... I don't know how well that's focusing. But, I'm getting into it now. I'm gonna keep plugging away here. And again, I'll show you what I get at the end of the day. And I did get these, these little pockets sucked out really good. That worked fairly well. I mean, it's really slow, but it works. Well, I'm still pulling it out of here. I just scraped the bottom of this here and did a pan. Got 27 pieces. I'm not getting the, like, bigger chunky pieces that I was getting before over in here, but I'm still pulling gold out. Um, since I last shot, I've done, I don't know, about seven more pans with, like, 14, 15 pieces in it. And that piece is loose, but I, I just can't get the damn thing out of there. I keep bending that, and I keep trying my shovel, but I don't know. I'm not going to give up on it. But And I know these pieces, if I'm methodical about it, they'll come out of there. I'm sure they will. But anyway, I don't know how well you'll be able to see the gold in the pan. basically what I'm pulling out now you know your oddball 
one or two big pieces per pan, which aren't real big, but gold is gold. And I'm getting a pretty good amount today. I'm tempted to go over there and just try in between rocks like this area right here and see if anything comes out of it. There's pockets up in there. We'll see. Maybe when it gets to the point where I can't get any more out of there with my shovel without breaking it, I'll give it a shot and see what happens. Catch you in a bit. Now there's only nine in this pan. It's only about maybe 20 minutes since I shot last. And this is just from washing off rocks. But there's one, one decent sized piece out of that. I got them out of there. All that's moving. Wiggling, wiggling the rock, wiggling it, wiggle, 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 wiggle. <laughs> Just a whole lot of shaking going on. <laughs> but all of this is moving. Every bit of it. I don't know about that. I think this is pretty solid right here, these pieces. But time will tell. That one's already loose. I gotta wash it off. I really wish I remembered to bring my pry bar today. I would have been a whole lot farther than I am. Oh well. Catch you in a bit.
biggest piece of the day out of the bottom. Nice flake, it's pretty flat. I don't know how many are in there, I didn't count it as you can see. I'm kind of trying to hurry up at this point. Sun's going down. Alright, so I'll uh, show you the what's in the snuffer bottle for the day in a minute here. I'm just going to gather everything up and get ready to get out of here. Give you a last look at the uh, what I've done. Everything all through here. All up in there a little bit. Washed all that down the other day and broke a lot out of here today. Rinsed all that right down really good. Best I could anyway. I see there's still material in that pocket. A little bit up in there. But probably didn't leave too much behind. If I had a pry bar, I could probably get more out of here. Some other day, maybe. All right, catch you in a bit. Okay, I'm pretty much gathered up here. That last pan had 28 pieces in it. <coughs> and that. Is the gold for the day. Not too shabby. I like it. Not every day you can get results like that here in Vermont. Well, it depends on where you go. In my neck of the woods, no. So, I think I've done pretty good here. I think I've done pretty good. Alright, I'm out of here. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and leave a comment. I answer every single one of them. Until it gets so damn big I can't. <laughs> but it ain't that big yet, so. Alright, take care everybody.